using text-to-speech software to make a voiceover for a video is becoming more popular with ever-improving AI technology. And it is quite logical. We already have AI writing tools that can create video scripts in a minute like Jasper or Ritter. We also have AI-powered tools that can transform the written text into an engaging video like within video or Pictory. So the next step is adding AI to create a human-like voiceover. So where is the problem? Let's create a video completely with AI. To be honest, the question of whether you can monetize text-to-speech videos on YouTube is a little more complex than it may sound. So, if you're expecting a simple answer, then I cannot get it to you. This is because there is no simple answer. So, what exactly mean when someone is talking about text-to-speech? Text-to-speech is the process of converting text into spoken words. Most common uses of text-to-speech are in assisted technology, computers, and mobile phones. The most well-known example is Siri, which is a speech recognition software for Apple iPhone devices. Text-to-speech can be done manually or through the use of advanced AI technology. If we're talking about voiceovers for YouTube videos, we're talking about using AI technology like Murph or NVIDIA. YouTube has a variety of monetization rules that are unique to the platform. These rules can be found in YouTube Partner Program policies. However, the monetization rules are not straightforward and can be quite confusing for both content creators and advertisers. This is because YouTube has different types of ad formats, which means that content creators need to understand what type of ads they will display in order to make money on YouTube. There are three types of ads on YouTube, non-skippable, pre-roll, and mid-roll. Non-skippable ads are the most popular type with over 80% of impressions on YouTube coming from these ads. Pre-roll ads are only shown before a video starts playing, while the mid-rolls show at the during and end of a video. Here are the most important rules and policies you have to follow to get monetized. Community guidelines, terms of service, copyright, Google AdSense program policies. So if you are asking yourself, if does YouTube allow text-to-speech software use in videos, then to be honest, in any of these policies and guidelines, YouTube has not made a direct statement on disallowing monetization for channels with text-to-speech videos. However, YouTube has issued guidelines on the type of content that violates its policies. Here's a list that seems to apply the usage of text-to-speech voices. Content that exclusively features readings of other materials you did not originally create, like text from websites or news feeds. Songs modify to change the pitch or speed, but are otherwise identical to the original. Similar repetitive content or mindless content with low educational value, commentary, or narrative. Templated, mass-produced, or programmatically generated content. Image slideshows or scrolling text with minimal or no narrative, commentary, or educational value. While there are minimum requirements you need to meet, to really get accepted into the YouTube Partner Program, your channel will be reviewed by a YouTube team. If your YouTube channel is high quality, you might be accepted into the program in a matter of days. However, if you are using any AI tools, you are definitely wondering what criteria this platform emphasizes for successful adoption. They review and focus on a few things of your channel like main theme, the biggest proportion of watch time, most viewed videos, newest videos, video metadata like thumbnails, including titles and descriptions. However, these aren't the only things the YouTube team can review. They might review other things about your channel as well. Let's get back to the main question. There are people that are saying that using text-to-speech voices is not allowed on YouTube and will not get accepted into their partner program. However, there are still tons of channels that are running ads and using other features that only monetized channels can. In my opinion, you can use AI-generated voiceovers, but you have to add value to your content. In the past, many creators have used simple and robotic voices for their videos, but what they did wrong is that they used a text from Wikipedia articles, Reddit posts, or blog articles, and add robotic voices to create spammy content. I have recently started two faceless YouTube channels with the use of AI voiceovers when I'm making highly engaging videos from my own scripts. This is important because I'm adding value. So in a near future, I'll see if it works or not. Using text-to-speech voices for your videos doesn't mean you cannot get accepted into YouTube Partner Program even people on YouTube don't give you a straightforward answer. In my opinion, to avoid complications with your channel, you should create engaging video content from your own scripts. If you use text-to-speech voices in your original video and the vocalizations will help to enhance its educational value, then it is highly unlikely YouTube will penalize you for using TTS voices. 
Thank you for watching, and if this video was helpful, then leave a like or comment. All your effort will be appreciated.